I am Tracy McCausland and live in Waterloo and grew up in Iowa Falls and will be speaking at the luncheon. I was diagnosed in 2017 with um, stage two breast cancer. So I'm about four years out and um, received great treatment at the University of Iowa in Iowa City. I went through 16 rounds of chemo um, followed by surgery and then ever since have been on uh, medicine it's called tamoxifen that I take one pill a day and so far so good it hasn't come back. Mostly do corporate training and leadership development and team building and helping people understand kind of how they tick and how others tick and um, using their strengths productively to create great places to work. Uh, this is my first, I think, a cancer-related speaking engagement, but I'm super excited uh, that Mrs. Rudy invited me and you know, excited to be back here in Iowa Falls to do it. Oh, Iowa Falls is a special place in my heart. My parents' first job out of college was teaching high school here, and they retired 30 plus years later teaching high school here. And uh, you know, I was just born and raised. I think Iowa Falls is really a special and unique community. And so, when Mrs. Rudy invited me to speak, it, it never crossed my mind not to. So I'm excited that the funds are staying local and. Um, that people are, you know, coming together for a great, great cause and really taking action to help um, people that are going through this pretty awful disease. I was 39 when I was diagnosed, so typically mammograms aren't recommended until you turn 40. So I think from my personal experience, I would recommend um, self examination because that's how I found um, my tumor and um, there's different information out there as far as as that topic is concerned but that's just my own personal experience was that's how I found it and then I think once you're in that um, category for mammograms and screenings I mean I think being proactive with your health is important and you know there's so much treatment and research now um, where they can you know help if you're catching uh, breast cancer early enough as long as we just kind of keep our pedals on the gas in terms of research and advocacy for you know legislation and laws that are going to help people um, live longer with this disease and hopefully someday have a cure for it you know i think we can get beyond awareness